Hello guys, welcome once again. In this video, I will show you how to use timers with your Visual Basic Windows Form application. So what is a timer? Generally, we use timer when you need to give some interval to some function or some procedure. So for example, you want to show a message every one second or every 10 second, you can use timer to execute this. Or for example, you need to increase a value by 10 every one second then you can use timer for that so let's see how we can use timer in visual basic so I will go to the toolbox and I will search for the timer and I will drag and drop to my form and you will notice when I drag and drop this timer to my form it will go down here and not directly to the form because it's not a visible tool it's an invisible tool right and now for the demonstration I will take a button actually I will take two buttons and I will take a text box from here okay now what I will do is I will change the text of this first button as start timer and the second button text as stop timer and I will change the text of this text box and I will give the value 1 here okay and let me change the font size of this um, button so we can see it better okay this is the stop button and this is the start timer button and we have this text box so I will change the text box font okay now we have start timer button stop timer button and this text box and this timer now first of all I will go to this timer I will select this timer and in this timer tick event I will write text box 1 which is the name of my text box dot text is equal to once again text box 1 plus one for example okay so this means that whenever I add here I forgot the text here okay so whenever I enter something of uh, any number in the text box which is already there which is one it will increase that number by one whenever this timer ticks now we need to start and stop the timer also right so we have this button and here we will say double click this button and we say timer 1 which is our timer dot start and if you don't know where this timer 1 comes from just select this timer and see the name of this timer it's timer 1 right and same we will do for stop we will say timer one dot stop okay so this button click start the timer and this button click stop the timer but how does the timer know that after how many second or after how much interval it should tick so let's see how we can set this time timer interval just select your timer and in the properties you will see a property called timer right so you can set the interval from here now this interval is in milliseconds so when you write 1000 milliseconds here it will tick your timer by one second right so I have set it here 1000 milliseconds now I will run the program to demonstrate and when I start the timer it ticks 
and it increases the value of the text box by one every second right and when I press stop button it stops the timer once again start the timer it starts and when I stop the timer with this button it stops so in this way you can use timer with your usual basic windows form application and in the next video I will show you how to show real date and time which is running every second using this timer tool so stay tuned and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now